Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. So today I'm going to talk about how you can get your IP address, the Brazilian IP address that you're looking for. It's very easy when it comes to accessing different content from all over the world and really all it takes is changing your IP address using a good VPN. So I'm guessing that's why you want to change your IP address. It's so that you can get access to all kinds of content that belong to that IP address and country. So let's just start by demonstrating using ExpressVPN. As you can tell on my IP address finder, it says that I'm in the United States, not because I'm in the States, but because I was just connected to the New Jersey server. So all you need to do is download and install, by the way, one of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing discounts in the description down below if you end up picking any of them up or if you'd like to save some money. And once you have access to the application, let's just go with Express again to demonstrate and go to Americas in this case and pick Brazil. Just turn on the VPN and that's basically it. Now, if you want to double check, all you have to do is refresh the IP finder and it's as simple as that. Now, let's say if I were to go to Netflix, it would give me access to the Brazilian Netflix library. And the same thing applies to all the other websites since my browser will think that I'm now in Brazil and not just that nobody will be able to know what I'm doing online since a VPN also protects my data from any prying eyes like my ISP or potentially government. Now, as far as which one to choose, they all work remarkably well. I've tested over a couple of dozen VPNs that have narrowed it down to these three as the best overall. I would just sum it up by ExpressVPN being the best of the best overall. It's the most reliable and consistent, especially when it comes to accessing region restricted websites and streaming services and whatnot as well as online sports books. And it's also very reliable when it comes to protecting your data since they have arguably the best privacy policy in the business and they have plenty of proof showing that they do not collect any information about their data. Same thing with Nord and Surfshark. It's just that ExpressVPN has more evidence to show. And so that's why I like to choose it over any other VPN. Now you have 100 countries with Express, by the way, and you'll be able to secure up to eight devices per subscription. Now NordVPN will allow for up to six devices per subscription and you'll have have 111 countries at your disposal. So the biggest number of countries out of all other VPNs, this is absolutely the best well-rounded VPN that offers a whole bunch of bonus features for a very reasonable price while still maintaining very high levels of security and arguably the fastest VPN in the business. Thanks to the NordLynx protocol, it makes NordVPN again, arguably one of the fastest VPNs, if not the fastest VPN in the market. Now, if you're looking to secure virtually an unlimited number of devices with just a single subscription, so you can share it around with as many friends and family members as you would like. And you also have a hundred countries still, so that's a decent amount. And also the best budget VPN that gets the job done at the cheapest possible cost without sacrificing any of the premium features that you could see with more expensive VPNs like NordVPN, ExpressVPN, then Surfshark would be the best option here. Why? Well, you're simply getting the most value for your money, the biggest bang for the buck. And to just showcase that in a way, if you take a look at the one plan with Surfshark, which offers a VPN, a fully fledged antivirus, a couple of identity protection features and a safe search feature and so on and so forth. Basically, it's a full cybersecurity package on offer here. And even though it's considered a higher tier plan with Surfshark, which should be more expensive, it's still cheaper than NordVPN's standard plan. So that's how much value you're getting with Surfshark. And again, you can share that account with many of your friends and family with just a single profile. So that'll be it for this video. And it's as simple as that with regards to getting access to a Brazilian IP address. Now, if you end up getting any of these VPNs, I'd recommend knowing exactly what you want to go for here. Because if you want to use the VPN for just a month, you can just go for the monthly plan. But if you end up using it longer than a month and you stay on that monthly plan, it's just going to cost you a whole lot more. Basically double the yearly plan. Now, if you know you're not going to need it for more than a month, definitely get that. But otherwise, get the yearly plan or the six month plan so that you can save a whole lot more in the long term. And of course, you'll find all the links to pricing discounts and the full reviews to all these VPNs in the description down below if I haven't already mentioned that. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.